Hello, this is Chiak. We are back again with another set of Siberia 3. Now, we have the means to get the Yukols across the lake. Preferably... Is it already night, though? Do we want to be traveling, then? Where's Kurt? Hey, madame? Uh-oh. Oh, you're... <laughs> Miss Kate Walker found another way for Yukos to cross Sacred Lake? Yes, it's unbelievable. I found a boat that can take all of you and your herd, too. The captain, Captain Obo, is waiting for us at the port. First, we all must wait Kirk. Guide of Yukos, made like new with his new magic leg. Simon Steiner. The Valsenbor clockmaker finished Kirk's prosthesis and took it to the clinic. They're going to come down together and meet us on board the crystal. So Yukols make use of night to pick up entire camp. Much, much work for us tonight. <laughs> Getting somewhere. It's just a minor setback. As long as their spiritual guide is here, in our hands, the nomads are going nowhere. I hope you know what you're doing, Olga Ethimova. The rest of my men won't be arriving for another few hours. It'll be hard to keep those savages here without breaking heads. And I don't want to create a scandal here on the Balsam War. Don't worry, Colonel. If we do it my way, we won't need your army of mercenaries to solve the Yukal problem once and for all. My god, what on earth can they be doing? What are they doing? Please calm down, Captain. Sarah promised to send Steiner and Kirk down as soon as they get there from the clinic. I'm sure they'll show up. It doesn't matter if they turn up now or an hour from now. We were supposed to leave before night time. I'm warning you, there's no way I'm taking my ship out onto the lake just when it's the monster's meal time. Listen, if it makes you feel better, we can leave tomorrow at dawn. Until then, I'll go see how everyone is getting on. And you try to calm down a bit. Everything will be fine, Captain. Okay. I mean, considering... Okay. I figured that they'd be leaving at dawn anyway if they're using the cover of night to... to... to make their way into the city in order to get onto the ship. Where is everybody, though? That's the question. There was a stairs that went down. Oh, wait, the hello. must not leave at night, Miss Catwalk. Okay, well, there's see, look. Your passengers are in agreement, sir. Also, can I just say... The music was actually loud enough that it was kind of hard to hear the dialogue of the characters Who speaking. Need much, much fresh air when ostriches leave? Nanook metal really safe? Okay. Uh, the question is, where is everybody else? There is a downstairs here. I never. I'm not sure if I saw if I could go down. Here we go. The answer's that. Ooh, it's really dark. 
It is incredibly dark. I can't really see. Is there some there? There is. Oh, look at you guys hard at work. Phew. Captain could maybe help. Okay, what was that voice? Mm -hmm. Workbench too high. Okay. Oh boy. Oh my god, it's so dark down here. I'm not sure. Where's this? Looks like everybody's in place. Perfect. I'm sorry, where is this? Is this... Where on the ship is that? Okay. Oh, well, Kate's very proud of herself right now. Uh, in the meantime... Oh my god, I can't navigate because I don't know where I'm heading. I can see the stairs here. She won't walk any further. Okay, I'm gonna assume I can't go that way. Oh wait, are those stairs right here? Okay, those are stairs. Is this is ridiculous? Oh my god, camera, please, please just work with me here. Thank you. Let's go out the back, see if anyone's back here. There has to be someone back here. Nope, they're all hiding in the ship, huh? Out of sight. How many yukols were there? Oh, hi. You're not quite out of sight. You're quite out in the open. Okay, but you have your reasons. <laughs> it's a bit too claustrophobic for you. Never actually checked. Kate. Oh, hi. Hi. Sarah, is everything all right? It's grandfather. He hasn't come back from the clinic. Maybe putting on Kirk's prosthesis took more time than he thought it would. That's just what I thought too. But when I took the vernacular to go look for him in the clinic, I saw everything up there has been closed up, and there are armed men in the lobby. Oh, maybe those are the soldiers with that colonel who's chasing us. They're holding grandfather. I just know it. I have to go save him. Young Tak Moon is right. Miss Kate Walker must hurry and go back to clinic and save Kirk. And Grandfather, what will you do about him? Okay. <laughs> no way, I won't leave anyone behind. Miss Kate Walker must not forget all the things that Yukols did for her. Remember, you a Grandfather a lot too. Calm down, both of you. I'll bring them back, but I need the two of you to keep your heads. Miss Kate Walker must take this. We'll need it up there. What's that? And how can you know what I might need? Spirits not just send really bad signs. <laughs> now, Miss Kate Walker must return back in clinic. I'm off. In the meantime, tell the captain to be ready to leave. Too bad if it's dark out. If the Colonel and his men are really up there, we'll need to leave the second I come back here with Kirk. Okay, so the lighting in the cutscene got really weird. Also good to know that the, the old Shannon lady, she can still laugh despite the fact that some urgency is happening here. What are you guys doing? Hello, get on the ship. We might leave. Not now. Drive no spirits guide Miss Catwalk. Okay. Miss Catwalk, very, very nice to see her. Very nice to see you too. So we're gonna take the vernacular up, I'm gonna assume. Uh oh, what's up? What's happening here? 
What's happening here? There's a crowd. I don't think that's a good thing. Oh no! Time at the bar, everybody. We're closed. Please leave before the police show up. Okay, good. Everything's just closing. And you need to get them to leave. I don't know how, I mean, empty streets, I'm not sure how good of a thing that will be. Okay, I'm gonna, s so I'm assuming I take the vernacular out because, well, I mean, we definitely can't go back the way we came considering it was out through a pipe. On a very downhill river raft, almost. It's amazing she didn't fall off that boat. Okay, up, up, up. My dear lady, please wait! Mr. Mayor, what is it? Things have gotten worse. Soldiers have just arrived in Valsimbor. I'm afraid the militia is the right arm of the new authorities in our country. And I don't like it. Those people have no scruples at all. They've taken over the clinic and the military. Yes, I was just about- If they learn I authorized you to open the locks, I'll be banished to the taiga. Oh my god, it's terrible, horrible, atrocious. Don't worry, Mr. Mayor. We'll be leaving very soon. Perfect, perfect. But if you're captured first, I'm counting on you to keep my name out of things, even if they use torture. Ah, uh, well, it goes without saying, Mr. Mayor, that you can count on me. That's excellent. So then, so you have a good evening, dear lady. <laughs> it's uh, good to know that you have so much faith that she can endure torture and not reveal your name. <laughs> Oh my goodness, this guy. I was wondering why there was a cutscene showing up. Hello? Get up there. Oh, come on. There's a reason why we have to go around. Okay. Mm-mm-mm. So we need to start up the vernacular, of course, uh, lock. No, I need to find something else. What's with this zoom in? What's going on? Do I have an object for this? A shaman's beverage. Not quite what I was looking for. Oh, no. What does she expect me to do with this? Is it actually a beverage? Though it doesn't work. Okay, so we can put stuff down there. What do we got? I don't got anything. A knife. Not a chance. Okay, so we're supposed to slide something down the door. Hmm, nothing to look at over here. Oh no. The soldiers must have called the funicular back after Sarah left. I have to find a way to send it down to the platform. Okay, well, that's our goal. So what other items... My only issue right now is this area is fairly, it's big enough that are you actually expecting me to go all around town and try to figure out So my question is, what do I, uh, what do I use? Like, I don't get what that I don't get what I'm supposed to be doing with that door. That's the question. That's the thing. I mean, 
do I have to go back, talk to the girl, and ask for advice of how to get the thing back? Because that would be the, that would be really annoying backtracking. It's mm. Mm. anyone here? Maybe can you? Do you have any advice? Remove every last trace of those hooligans coming to our town. That's what Mayor Bulia Keen said. Okay. I'm sure the dust you are sweeping is a good sign that these hooligans are gone. Because they bring in special dust. Maybe it sparkles, maybe it glitters. Who knows? I don't know what your sweeping is going to do, but you do what you do, sir. I have a clinic to break into and armed men to pass by. How? Uh, how am I supposed to do this? Wait, there's also... Apparently some of the nomads are walking around freely in the port. Can you believe that? Guys, you're supposed to be on the ship. Like, now is not the time to upset the locals, considering... Okay, so, I mean, I guess, let's see what can Sarah tell me, or someone? Because, again, like, besides the this beverage that I have in my hand, I'm not quite sure who I should be, what I, what's the, what am I trying to do underneath the door? Please, Kate, bring Grandfather back. She's got nothing. Mm. Who do I talk to? I don't see how talking to the captain is going to bring me anything. I better, I hope not, because I'm walking away. But... I mean, what do I have on hand with me currently? I have a heart, knife, and the shaman's beverage. So you... Hmm. I just wish there was a bit more direction of what I should be doing. She's looking for a way to call it back. Let's... See if I can find anything in the uh, the Steiner's store, but hmm. You're still out here. Oh wait. Evening, madam. What? Um... Oh god, Kate's stuck. What? I'm stuck. I think I am. I can't get her to move back and these guys are in the way. Okay, cool. it wasn't that long ago. Okay, I'm gonna load this. I mean, there's there's literally nothing else I can do because I'm, like, I can't move. I try to push her back and she won't go. So I have to I have to do I have to load in this auto save. If I'm retreading over things I've already seen before, then I'll just I just won't bother. Okay, good. So, yeah, that's after she, that's after she was implored by uh, by the daughter 
by the daughter. So I'm going to assume, just making sure, I come back over here, I'm going to hit a cutscene. Or at some point I'm going to hit a cutscene. Oh my god, I hate walking this game. And then I'll know... Everything's right as rain. You know, if I could move around better. Yeah, they definitely need to needed to work more on the character movement, a mobility in this game, along with the camera. Yeah. Okay. And there's no way for me to skip. My this. dear lady, please wait. Okay. Yeah. Mr. Mayor, so I have to see this. Yeah, I have to see it. So. I can, there's two areas where I can put something or something or other under the door. Um, but she's, I mean, it's not like, because when I think about something being placed under the door, it makes me think of like knocking a key out from the lock and then getting that key, but I don't think that's the case. <coughs> Excuse me. So the question is, what am I... Like, she doesn't make a comment. That's one thing that's annoying me right now. She makes no comment. There's no hint so far in this game, verbally, so... Without a hint, like, without some sort of weird hint system put in place to do for you to suggest what you should do. But she's not making any suggestions either, so I'm, I don't understand what the puzzle wants me to do. I mean, is there more that I can see here? Okay, so let's head on up. Oh no. Oh, of course, she passed right by it. Okay, so let's at least enact this cutscene. Hello? Again, it's like this thing's so finicky. Come on. Oh no. The soldiers must have called the funicular back after <coughs> Sarah left. I have to find a way to send it down to the platform. Okay. So that's just to have a look at that. This is to block our way. Ah, oh, no, I need to find something else. Okay. Never actually looked up yet. So there's another thing about this game is the fact that you have to I mean I don't know if I had to if I should be docking at points for this as a mainly what the issue here for me is being able to move the camera around like this is the fact that I'm not used to it in the venture game. Usually it's very stationary, so I don't expect it. Those must be the controls for the car. I have to get in somehow. Okay. So, there's our goal. That's a pretty big gap. Okay. Impossible. That's not right. Let's try something else. Nothing. No way. Not a chance. Okay, I don't imagine the documents are... Yeah, documents aren't going to bring anything up. So we have to collect two items, I would say. In order to... Really what I want to do is get a hammer, take off... It looks like, I mean, it can, it's kind of weird because it looks like those, these knobs are on the outside. <laughs> and then, uh, pull them off. And then the door is... We can, uh, we can just go through. So, question for me right now is where, what item can I get? Hello. See, this is the part I didn't see. It's 
suddenly open. Wedges. Uh oh. Yeah, Kate. <laughs> I don't know why you look so shocked the fact that it was clearly keeping that cart from moving. How many pieces do I have? Okay, well, we're just going to... We're just going to vacate. Shh. No one saw a thing. Kate, run up there. Skedaddle. Oh, no, 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 over here, Kate, over here. There we go. Okay, I'm still good on time. Oh, come on. Change the view. There we go. Nope, back here. Now look down. Yeah, so we have three wedges. Oh, my God. Um, again, my mouse disappeared. Okay, there we go. I think she just got stuck on the door somehow. Yeah, she's stuck on the door again. It doesn't matter. Okay, so I don't know why we need three wedges. Oh, we have a small wedge, wedge, and a wedge. Let's just get... It doesn't work. Nothing. What? Oh, no. No! I saw- I saw what it did there. Lifted it up. Okay, then we get the big wedge. Then I grab that one. Then I put this one on the other side and get the other big wedge. Okay. There's more to this? <coughs> Excuse me. What more can I do? Not a chance. Oh, whoopsies. Sorry, I was trying to grab a wedge. Or maybe, oh no, wait. I get the big wedge over there, right? Let's try something else. No? No way. Impossible. It doesn't work. That's not right. Nothing. That's not right. Oh wait, I'm trying the wrong thing. I mean, I can't tell if it's lifted up more than it needs to be lifted up. Okay, it's teetered. Yeah, we can only put it there, from what I can tell.
not a chance. That's our goal. But what does this want me to do? Can I... Can't do anything else. So it has... I mean, it looks like it's off already. Okay. Okay. Maybe... See, we can't no way use either of these on either side. It doesn't work. I, I, I'm just trying to understand what I need to do at the current moment. Okay, so, and there's only two places I can put the small wedge. There or there. You get the big wedge. Now, the big wedge shouldn't fit under here. Impossible. Right. But it'll fit under there. So that lifts that up. You can take this up. We can't use the big wedge Let's yet. Let's try something else. It doesn't work. Okay. That's not right. Oh wait. Okay, so small wedge. That lifts it up even more. Or do these two wedges have different? Impossible. You need a lot of room to use this. See, it's that or I'm missing an item. Which I say is a possibility. Okay, let's very quickly... Head back down to that area. Maybe there's something on that cart? Me. Like, okay, so let's see if I can find... I've scrolled down a bit too far. Um, okay, so there is quite a bit more to this game, I have to say. Oh my god, there is a whole lot more to this game. Oh my god. Okay, rescue Kirk. Pass Steiner's shop. Click on support wedge. Get two wedges. Make sure you grab the additional third wedge, which it kind of just gave it to me, so I didn't have to grab it. Head upstairs. Click on door, then scroll over, click the window. Scroll down, click on the bottom door, then click. Use small wedge on the right side, then the bigger one. Take the small wedge out, put it on the left side, then the other big wedge next to it. Finally, take the small wedge and put it on top of the big wedge on the right. Okay. Was that still an option? I didn't realize. Oh, it technically is. Wait, what's what's this? No, I saw it. stuck. Excuse me, I have a knife. This knife is useful for anything. There we go. Let there be light and electricity. Mouse, I sort of need you in order to. Because, you know, that's not going to attract attention at all. No one's going to notice the vehicle moving down. Those soldiers... They're like, oh, yes, this is supposed to happen. Okay. We do... Oh. Kate, get out of the room. Here we go. I'm sure if I get past this, because since this is an auto save, oh my god. 
Oh no, I literally cannot go down any farther. I have to. I don't have a choice. Listen to my voice, young Yukel. Listen to the voice of a very dear friend, Kirk. You are the guide of your people. He who shows his Yukel brothers the path of modernity and progress. These archaic migrations that you persist in perpetuating are now but ridiculous reflexes. You must take your people back where they came from and have them settle down. Build real houses, schools, and factories. The nomadic life will no longer be possible in the world of tomorrow. Okay, uh, first things first, before I, I mean, okay, yeah, so good, it, I didn't see the, the gears, so I wasn't sure, either way, I'm going to end the set here, so, thank you for liking if you like, thank you for commenting if you commented, thank you for subscribing if you subscribed, thank you for favoriting if you favorited, Thank you for simply clicking on this video. Until next time, guys. See ya.